Poshmark has a an awful track record for rolling things out really slow. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Melissa, also known as The Thrifty Broad, and today is Friday shipping. So, um, I have, hold, how many do I have? Uh, on Poshmark, I have one, two, three, four, four, and on uh, eBay, I have three. So, all, e all three from eBay came in today, and actually... Like only a couple of the ones from Poshmark are from yesterday, like after I filmed my video. So here we are today. Anyway, so I'm going to do the same as I did last, yes, last day, yesterday. <laughs> and I'm going to package everything up and then do the what's little video afterwards. So, um, yeah, so let's, I guess what I did. I pre-printed my Poshmark labels. Yay. So I think I'll do Poshmark first. All right. So I hope you had a good day yesterday. And uh, you made lots of sales. How are your sales doing? I think I ask that every time. Let me know. Um, I don't know. I don't know if they're bouncing. I don't know if they're bouncing back on uh, Poshmark or not. Like, I kind of feel like they are, but I don't know. So I don't know. I mean, not that long ago. I know I talked about this, I think, in a previous video. Um, not that long ago, uh, selling under 30. I think the channel is called, um, I can never remember the long names, so I'm sorry if I butchered that. Um, they had a video that they had contacted Poshmark and um, about the algorithm, and they admitted that the algorithm hadn't actually been rolled back for everyone, which I'll tell you, I was not surprised by that because Poshmark has a an awful track record for rolling things out really slow. Like, I don't know if they do some like features by alphabetical. I'm, my last name starts with V, like in Victor. And I swear to God, they do it by alphabetical order. Cause I always get that, the new features like two to three months after everyone else got it. I don't know, that's a speculation on my part. I have no idea how it really works cause they won't tell us how it really works. However, um, I just know it takes me a long time to get any new thing. Let me know when you, when Poshmark comes out with a new feature and you have, well, it doesn't even matter what your last name starts with, but I mean, does it take forever for it to get to you too? Or do you seem to get them pretty fast? I don't know. I don't know what the thing is, but anyway, so figure out who this person is because apparently I can't read and talk at the same time. All right. Well, it's one down. My mail lady already came, so I'm doing this. That is eBay. I want to do all my Poshmark first. Lost my train of thought. Welcome to menopause. Um, God, what was I going to say? I have no clue. Anyway, so yeah, it's. I really just wish they wouldn't have messed around with the, the algorithm, to be honest. But you know, it's their platform; they can do what they want with it. And we are literally just guests on their platform. So, and I think some people are starting to go with their own, like a Shopify store where they call the shots, you know, they work out their own shipping and stuff like that. But then there's a lot of extra stuff you have to do. But, um, I know the Yogi closet, she's been working on that. I follow her on Instagram and I like her post and she has an adorable child. So, um, yeah. So yeah, she, she has been trying to kind of, I think she said get off Etsy and just be on her own platform where she calls her own shots. And I really commend her for it because that is no easy feat. I'm sure this has not been easy for her to do, but I commend her for trying to be perfectly honest. And I hope she's successful. Um, okay. Go look at who this is. So I don't put the wrong one on there because that would suck. I haven't done that in years since I worked for the hospital I used to work for. Um, that was the last time it happened. And I haven't worked for that hospital in since 2019. Yeah. Yeah, because that's when I went full time. Okay, so this next one. This is actually folded pretty awfully, so I'm going to kind of refold it so it doesn't look bad because it's been in that plastic for a little while. So, 
sometimes I will unfold things and refold them so they look a little better. I'm not going to steam it because, yeah, I don't actually care that much about that. But, you know, I want it to be folded nicely and it wasn't before. So. I know there are some people that will press everything before they send it out. That's cool. If that's you, more power to you. I'm not doing that, but more power to you. I just know. Plus, my hands would hate me if I did that. They would be so mad. <laughs> okay. Who are you? You're this person. Okay. I am excited because today looks more like spring than winter, like a couple days ago. If you follow me on Instagram, um, I woke up to snow and it was snowing these big fat flakes and it was like 31 degrees. So it was below freezing. And if you, if you uh, know Celsius, I think that's minus two Celsius. Um, yeah. <laughs> or maybe it was when it was 29 degrees. I don't know. I, I, my husband, he's, I, I know I've said this many times, but maybe you're new. Um, my husband's British. And so he, his phone is always in Celsius. And of course I'm American. So my phone is always in Fahrenheit. And so I was like, check him. Like what temperature is it in Celsius? Cause I'm not doing that math. Not doing that math. Okay. So you are shit. And one more. Okay. I wish this would have sold for more. It didn't, but that's okay. I will look at that in a minute. Okay. Let's see. Will you fit in here? I think I have to put in the bigger one. I have some bigger black ones. Oh, that's not the bigger black one. That is a small black one. What? I know a bigger one. But I may not have them in here. Oh, they're up there. Okay, one moment. One momento. Is this the bigger one? No. It's this one. Okay, that's bigger. Okay. These ones are a bit thinner though. Oh well, they'll still it'll still be fine. Okay, so make sure that's the right person. Yes, I know, even though it's the last one. I still double check it because I just, I want to make sure, you know, and I think it's worth it to double check. Even if it's the last one, I've had ones, like I've said before in other videos, that something was printed out and it printed out something twice rather than, because I do print the bulk ones on uh, Poshmark. So, and I just, you know, find them, find the right ones. Okay. So let's go to... Okay, this one is an eBay, it's a three eBay. Or my eBay package, packaging. I do want to use this stuff. And if you haven't used, if you have an eBay store and you haven't used your shipping supplies, I use it literally at the beginning of every quarter just to make sure I don't forget because there's a good chance I will. All right, what do you weigh? 3.6 ounces. I'm pretty sure I marked it for four. So let's buy some shipping. How's the weather with you, where you're at? Let me know where you're at too. It's fun to know where people are, you know, watching from. I was looking at my analytics and there's like one person or a couple people that watch me from, I think it was India and some people from the UK. And I know it's not my family. So it's kind of interesting. And yes, I said it was four ounces, so it'll cost me four thirteen. Okay. All right, so I'm gonna put it on this side since it's like a bra, so it's bulging on one side. Okay. This is a sweater that I thought would go before. It didn't, so. And we'll definitely need to go into a bigger one. I only charge $8.30 for this one. Let's see. Okay, 
I need to do my trick. <laughs> Course, it's 994. Can I get her in a padded flat rate? Do you think? Let's see. Yeah, I think I could actually. I think I actually can. We're gonna do it. And there's a trick to sometimes if you can't get into padded flat rate, um, well. I'm going to redo this. Because I realized I'm going to have to get all the air out of this to make it work. So, um, and I did not do a great job with that. So, A, I'm going to take it out of here. I'm going to refold it. Let's see what we can do. Okay. Because it's not. I mean, there's a lot of fabric, but if you fold things the correct way, you can make it fit into a much smaller space. So let's see if I can do that on camera. <laughs> let's see. Okay, I'm gonna put this in here for now. That way we can watch me. Yeah, it's when it has so many layers, it's hard. But, you know, snip that thread. Okay. It is cute, though. I think she'll fit now. You think it's thicker? Now let's try this. Oh yeah, like a dream. Okay. Now, now to close it, right? big sweater, fold it correctly, get all the air out, you can get into a padded flat rate and it's a lot cheaper. So it's just when they're, it's a thinner like cardigan, if it was thicker, it'd be harder to do that with, of course. So we'll just hit the padded flat rate, yay. And it's kind of amazing, all three of my eBay sales from today, not one of them had promoted listings or were found from promoted listings. So that's pretty exciting. I'm not sure how that happened, but I'm not sure how I could figure out how that happened either, but you know. Um, and the last one is this. So let's go back to orders. Okay. All right, let's pull out these. Really? <laughs> Keep grabbing the wrong thing. Right. 11 ounces, so I mean so it will be 12, but 11 and 12 ounces are the same amount. is 517. 
cool. And this one's going to Wisconsin. Oh, and thank you again to the viewer who yesterday who uh, taught me how to say Raleigh. Did I say it right? Raleigh, North Carolina. I do appreciate that. Because I do suck at pronunci pronunciating. Pronunciation sometimes. I think we all can suck at it sometimes, honestly. Okay. So need to go to the post office. I have to go to the post office anyway, because I do need to go to Staples. I did not go yesterday. <laughs> Make this a little bit more intimate, if you will. Okay. Okay, so the first one that sold on Poshmark yesterday is this Cabby Women's Large, the bonus print blouse style 3428, blue red chiffon V-neck top. It sold for $17.00 um with a discount to to likers of course that went up so the discount on shipping price is two dollars and two cents and the fees were 340 my cog was two dollars and so i made a profit of nine dollars and 58 cents okay so the next one is tahari women's green large 100 percent linen short sleeve uh green t-shirt um green is not really in the title twice i just said it twice Anyway, this sold for $20 with discounted shipping because it was an offer to Likers. So $2 was my cost of goods. $202 was the discount. $4 is the fees. And so I made $11.98. That took about five months to sell. Um, and the other one took six months to sell. Uh, the next one is universal thread gray vintage midi button fly now that was the style name vintage midi button fly shorts women's six or 28 r they sold for 15 dollars. they were up there for 25 i knew it wasn't going to get 25 someone offered me 15 dollars. i was like yes i'll take that and so i paid i mean i uh my clock was two dollars i paid um the fees were three and so i made a profit of ten dollars which i don't mind making a ten dollar profit off a of target brand you know that's that's okay although i think when i go to the bins which i'll be going to bins tomorrow um i i am gonna start being a little bit more selective and trying to find things that sell at a higher price point than getting a ten dollar um I know I want to take home all the things. I want to save all the things, but I can't save all the things. I don't have the time or the energy to do that. So I need to start being more selective. I know people probably, people have been saying that for years and I know I've been resistant against it, but I just need to give into that because I like so many things and I, I think a lot of things are cute and they will sell, you know? So we'll see. We'll see. I mean, we'll see how I do. <laughs> Because, you know, I've gone in there with one Ikea bag and came out with four Ikea bags worth. So, uh, the last one is Old Navy Women's Extra Large Trucker Jacket, Bleach Stenciled Mandala, Painted Boho. I really thought this was going to do better. This took five minutes for it to sell. Um, I don't know. Maybe I need to do that on some more. I don't know. I do have some paint, though. So, some fabric paint that I want to kind of uh, use with some of my stencils and kind of play around with that. Cause I think painted denim was also going to be a thing this year. So, um, yeah, I might play around with that on some jeans and stuff. We'll find out. Anyway, it sold for $12. It was an offer to me. So I paid $2 for this, um, $2.95 were the fees. And so I made a profit of $7 and five cents. And okay. Now let's go to eBay. Okay, so eBay, I sold this L.L. Bean Women's Extra Large Purple 100% Cotton Turtleneck Long Sleeve Top. I'm really interested. It's I'm really it's it's really interesting how it sold now and where I get the end, you know, at the tail end of winter and the probably hopefully spring soon. Anyway, um, if the weather cooperates, it sold for seventeen dollars and fifty five cents. I mean, it was not very much money. Um, Five seventeen was the shipping. Two thirty-six dollars were the fees. I paid $2 when I got it. So I made a profit of $8.02. And that took three months. Uh, yeah, for about three months for it to sell. Spinx, this took um, about 22 days. 
or I think it's less than that. I don't think it was actually posted on the beginning of the month. Anyway, Spanx 30031R wireless lined black lace bandio bralette size extra large. Um, I did find the Spanx uh, size guide. And so I did put that up there because somebody's like, what is an extra large equate to? And I'm like, I don't know. But it looks like the extra large equates to a variety of sizes. So I put the, the thing up there. The person who asked about it did not buy it because I was on Poshmark. Oh, but I didn't put that on eBay and that's where it sold. <laughs> so that doesn't actually matter. Anyway, so um, I paid $1.74 for this. Um, it sold for $19.99 on eBay. Shipping was $4.13. Uh, $2.68 for the fees. And so I made a profit of $11.44. Not bad for a bra. Um, and then the last thing was that sacred threads that I had take out and re refold. Women's large, extra large, 100% acrylic Aztec Southwestern open front cardigan. Really cute. I wish I had fit me. Actually, no, I'm glad I didn't because I have too many clothes. Anyway, so it's over $38.30. Um, I paid $2 for it. Uh, the shipping was $8.30, as you saw. Uh, fees were $4.82. And so I made a profit of $23.18. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked this video. If you did enjoy it, get any value out of it, please give me a thumbs up on your way out and consider subscribing. I would love to have you. And if you want to leave me a comment, I would love to read it and respond to it. I respond to all my comments and, uh, and, and pretty quickly too. Anyway, so thank you again for watching and hope you have a great day.